So the wife was there when it happened, but then left the scene. You're right. That's pretty unusual behavior. She could be in shock. I saw some people do some strange things in the war after their buddies got hurt. Maybe. Maybe she doesn't give a fuck. According to the patrons, her old man was a piece of work. You don't think, Phelps, the guy was run over. So it worked out well for this broad. So what? Maybe she deserved to catch a break. Who knows? Yes? Hello? This is Patterson. Is this about my husband? We're investigating the incident, ma'am. I see. Come in, won't you? We wanted to give you the facts about the accident, ma'am. I appreciate that, but I think I know most of them already, Detective. He was hit by a car. Now he's dead. More is there to tell. Pardon me, but you don't appear to be too upset about it. Lester and I met on a furlough in 44. We got married that weekend. People don't understand it now, but that happened a lot back then. I see. So you probably did well to stick together this long. What's that supposed to mean, mister? I think it's about time you left. I have someone here, and I... Beg your pardon? You're going to have to run that one by us again, sister. It's okay, Lorna. I'm Leroy Sabo. Well, well. Nice to see you're comforting the grieving widow, Mr. Sabo. All right, wise guy. Do you have any intelligent questions you would like me to answer? You can confirm Mrs. Patterson's story. Lester lost at cards. He was kind of hard to control when he lost his temper. He turned without looking and walked right out in front of the car. It wasn't good. What's your relationship with Mrs. Patterson, Mr. Sabo? We're friends. Good friends. You expect me to believe that? Look, I was filing for divorce. Mental cruelty. Lester could be a mean son of a bitch. And Lester knew about that? No. I hadn't told him. Well, hasn't this worked out well for the two of you? I feel almost bad for busting in on this little rendezvous. How did the car come to hit Lester? He walked straight into the path of an oncoming car. You expect me to believe that, Lorna. It's all very convenient. Gambling for Lester was like the needle for a hophead. He was yelling at me. He was yelling at the whole world. I kind of felt sorry for the driver. The poor guy had no chance. You were arguing in the bar and on the sidewalk? We were always arguing. So what? Admit it. You were baiting him, pushing his buttons. We can easily get the full story from the regulars in the bar. All right. Lester was playing cards out back. He lost, of course, and wanted back in. He suggested I earn the money on my back to get a mistake. That was the proposition he was putting to his so-called buddies. So maybe I was a little angrier than usual. Let's just say I took exception to his idea. The bartender said that you and Leroy were planning to go into business together. Can you explain how you'll get the money to do that? I have a little money saved away. You're being economical with the truth, Lorna. You want to back that up, little man? You increased the premium on Lester's life insurance. GI insurance policies have a $10,000 payout. It was Leroy's idea. Lester lived on the edge. He was always getting into fights. Crap games, pinochle, you name it. Turns out it was good advice. It speaks to motive and premeditation, Lorna. You're forgetting the hit and run, detective. You and Mr. Sabo have an interesting day. I'm sure we will, officer. 
Now, if you could both just leave. We're leaving, ma'am. Sorry for your loss. I can see what a tough time you're having with all this. Come on, Phelps. Let's make ourselves scarce. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps, badge 1247. How can I help, Detective? Messages for me, please. Just one, Detective, from the coroner. Message reads, Phelps, see me at Central Morgue immediately. Results of the Patterson autopsy. Thanks for your help. I'm out of here, Lorna. I got a business to run. That's the son of a bitch right there. William Shelton? Yes. It doesn't look good, Shelton. You packing your bags and making a run for it? You know why we're here. Yes. The accident. We've got witnesses who can put this car at the scene, not to mention the physical damage. This is open and shut, Shelton. That coward thinks he can run from everything. I wonder he killed someone driving like this. Don't let that asshole get away. Enough games, Phelps. Take this guy out. Lay into his wheel arches. Come on. He's heading into the station. Go on. Get after him. Hold it right there, Shelton. that the cop who solved the big case and got promoted? Next time.
That son of a bitch right there. William Shelton? Yes. It doesn't look good, Shelton. You packing your bags and making a run for it? You know why we're here. Yes. The accident. We've got witnesses who can put this car at the scene, not to mention the physical damage. This is open and shut, Shelton. That coward thinks he can run from everything. His wheel arches. Come on. No wonder he killed someone driving like this. Don't let that asshole right, get away. That's it. Cuff him and we're done. Put your hands where I can see them. That's the How does a vehicular manslaughter rap sound, Shelton? I hit him. I admit it. I just panicked, but it wasn't my fault. What do you mean? The guy jumped right out in front of me. He came out of nowhere. There's nothing I could do about it. Why didn't you stop? I've had accidents before. That's it. We're done here. The DA is gonna love you. They weren't all my fault. I'm a surveyor. I need my license for my job. There were people around. A woman and a man were standing right next to him. I thought they could get him to a hospital. I'm telling you, it's not my fault. The guy is dead. Shelton. You can't be serious. William Shelton, you're coming downtown. We need to talk about a manslaughter charge. Are you fine? I don't know what you're talking about. We weren't doing nothing. I've seen you little sons of bitches brawling around my store. I'll show you. I'll, I'll teach you not to. Sir, drop the weapon. You've been drinking, sir. You don't really want to. Three times I've been robbed. Ain't nothing gets done about it.
Look out, more of them! Put them down! Reinforcements are on the way. Cease and assist. Stay down. Phelps, take this guy out. Eleven King calling KGPL. I've been involved in a shooting. Suspects are down. Need an ambulance to 540 West 9th Street. It's a code 4. Notify a supervisor and the coroner. Roger, 11K. All units be advised. Suspects are down at 540 West 9th Street. Shooting at Uncle Sam's Army surplus is code 4. Ambulance, south and all the